Hello, my name is Kai, and my group members are Faris and Alex. Our group is Cooperative Autonomous Robotic Exploration. Imagine you just successfully landed your rover on Mars. Amazing. Now you really want to explore specific areas, maybe take some rock samples, imaging, analyze the dirt, but you're not able to navigate to these key areas because on Mars, there's no GPS. There is no way to easily get directions or coordinates like you would on Google Maps. This is where our cooperative robot system comes in. Our robot system includes two devices, a rover and a drone. Here's an example case of our system. The drone has already landed at the area of interest and the rover will now navigate towards the area in order to perform analysis of the region, all without using GPS. Users of our technology may implement their own software in coordination with ours. Our project aims to utilize a cooperative system in order to traverse GPS-denied environments. Now, let's take a look at our project in action. Key components that are used in our project include the rover, drone, communication PCB, onboard computers, and a LiDAR sensor. Important features that make our project possible include the ultra-wideband, obstacle avoidance, robot communication, and ROS, which is Robot Operating System. Ultra-wideband allows us to know the location of a dice called the tag, relative to four anchors. Usually these four anchors are placed in static locations. For example, if you place them in four corners of a square room, you would know the locations of the tag anywhere in the room. Our solution places the anchors on our rover, which is a moving system. This way, we can always know the location of the drone relative to where the rover is. Existing solutions place these anchors in static locations, but our solution innovates on this idea by having the anchors move with the drone. This is our alternative to a GPS system and allows us to achieve centimeter accuracy of our navigation. The range of these devices can be up to 70 meters and consumes a low amount of power, allowing our system to function for long periods of time. Our project also boasts an efficient obstacle avoidance algorithm. Our algorithm utilizes the LiDAR sensor, which continuously scans the rim over 10 times a second. If the LiDAR detects an object, a red dot appears, if you look at the diagrams, we can see that the LiDAR is mapping a room without obstacles and produces the shape of a bedroom. The other picture shows objects all over the room, leading to the picture being very messy. By using LiDAR, we avoid other popular techniques such as image processing, which consumes lots of power and resources while maintaining high accuracy. The drone and rover transfer information through the use of NRF transceivers. The pictures show the PCB that was created to interface the Arduino Nano and the NRF module. In our tests, we had a reliable range of 30 meters between these communication devices. The framework of all our software is ROS, or Robot Operating System. This is state-of-the-art software used in the current robotics industry by utilizing a publisher-subscriber model to communicate data. We are able to feed all necessary data into this framework, and thus the rover and drone are able to make decisions on what steps to execute next. Future extensions that can be implemented could be machine learning and computer vision on board the drone and rover. Another improvement would be replacing our current radio communication system with LoRa, which has better range and faster communication rates. Lastly, we would like to have a stronger LiDAR sensor that is able to function no matter how bright the outside world is. Our current LiDAR sensor lasers are corrupted by the sunlight, which means that the only reliable operation time is the evening. In addition, we would have loved to add a mapping feature where the rover is constantly updating a map the more it explores. Once again, my name is Kai and our group name is Cooperative Autonomous Robotic Exploration. Thank you for listening to our presentation and have a great day.